morning. It is um, day four. We are currently in Karnak on the coast of Brittany and it's wonderful. There's a couple of different parts of Karnak, the old town and then the Karnak Plage, which obviously is the beach. We've chosen to stay down by the beach and Nikki did a phenomenal job of negotiating <laughs> with the receptionist at this hotel to get not only a cheaper room, but a better one too. So we've got a sea view. We've just had our croissants by the sea. Ah, oh, life is good. We're gonna ride up the coast towards Concano, which again has lovely beaches. I swam last night, which was so nice. So hoping to swim again this evening. We might stay in Concano, we might keep going. We don't haven't booked any accommodation, so there is a bit of faff every day. We're trying to work out where we're gonna stay and all that, which sort of tempers the um, wonderful freedom. I mean, like, you know, it's nice to be free, but equally it's kind of annoying to keep having to try and figure out where you're gonna stay, because obviously we've got budget constraints. Anyway, we're gonna go, we're gonna ride, and it's gonna be nice. <coughs> another nice bridge this is the Pont Aven so we're gonna try and find the town centre got a feeling it might be quite nice well turns out the Pont Aven is such a pretty place that I've entirely lost Nikki actually for the first time on the whole trip because I just keep stopping to look at stuff and she's like go 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 being the roadie so hopefully I'll find her down here she won't be too cross with me for dawdling. Aha! Yes, 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 yes! Another moment I've been waiting for all trip. We're really looking forward to a swim. Ticked that off. We had the oysters and now we're getting the ice cream. <laughs> so after much deliberation, I'm not sure what Nikki's gone for. What have you got? Praline. Oh, praline and? Praline. Just praline. Oh, they'd run out of pistachio. I have got melon sorbet and pear sorbet. I am pretty much in heaven. It is so, so nice. Mm, mm, mm. So pretty. Throughout Brittany, well, and indeed France, there's quite a lot of cycle routes. Some of them are like greenways, like old railway lines, gravelly stuff. Other ones are just quieter roads and things. So as you're riding along, you can blast along the big roads on your road bike. And when you fancy a change or a brake, if you see the green cycling sign, you know you can nip off down a road like this, basically. I mean, that kind of looks like heaven to me. Finally, got my beach. Got a Cronenberg. They freet, tray sole. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a swim. Very pretty, very touristy, but very pretty. So we've pedaled into a little old town called Locronon. Looks well lush. Going for this one. Not sure how well a Quenamon travels in a jersey pocket. <laughs> Maybe I'll strap it to my bike. Stop it, you flonker. <laughs> So nice. So wild. 
probably my favourite part of Brittany. And there have been some really nice parts, but this is so special. Well, as you can no doubt see, the weather has turned a bit mad. So we can't see very much of this beautiful area that we are visiting. We're nearly at Point du Rat, where there's a crepery. So we'll get some carbs and caffeine and then carry on our merry way. Here's what we could have seen. Not sure how much of this I'm filming. See you in to one, to one, to one and a, hopefully.